Hey guys, it has been raining tonight. It has been raining a lot, so Jax and I are doing RV activities. I already fed him, so now I'm eating. Um, I've been thinking about this project for a long time. Went to Ace Hardware, got a bunch of supplies. I'm going to try to kind of walk you guys through how I'm going to put it all together. Uh, but bear with me. This is a work in progress. I don't know if we're going to get it all done today and tested, but... Uh, I'm really excited about this, and I think you guys are going to like that, how it turns out. So I have lots of supplies here, guys. What the heck are we doing? Well, I had come to the conclusion that I had fixed my drinking water holding capacity, right? But still, the first thing I have to do every 12 days is dump my tanks. So the two tanks are really the issue. And what I've actually found that uh, people are doing, I, I researched this on YouTube, actually, is that... There's a recycling pro process involved where you can actually reuse some of your waste. And I have all the supplies to do this conversion right now. Uh, it's kind of a, sounds dirt like a dirty job, but it's gonna work. Just trust me with this. Uh, we're gonna be switching it so that uh, my toilet is only gonna be used for number ones, no more number twos, because we want it to be just a liquid form in that black tank. So what we're going to do first is um, actually tap into the bottom of the toilet area and then we're going to reroute where the liquid would be stored and reroute that right into my fresh water uh, line with, with a T. We're going to tap right into that and then uh, hopefully the filter system, I integrate the filter system, the filter system is going to completely uh, sanitize all of the liquids and make it drinkable. So let's get started in the bathroom. So what we're actually gonna do here, I'm gonna drop the funnel into the actual toilet bowl and everything, and then I'm gonna be splicing into the bottom of the funnel uh, between where the actual tank hits and where the actual toilet is, and then I'm gonna run it back along this way to tap into the fresh water. All right, I got my valve all installed here. This will be the on off switch uh, when I don't want to have the toilet water running through here. Uh, we're just gonna tap into it right here and then we're gonna add our filter at this point right here. All right, this is the filter I got on eBay and it's, it actually says right in the description that this will completely sanitize and repurpose urine. So we're gonna hook this guy in here and then bypass the hose. I have lots of hose so I can get this to wherever I need it to get to and I'm gonna run the hose uh, all the way back. Well, before we go any farther, I realize that I actually should drink some water so that I can uh, be able to purge the system because it's gonna take a few cycles to make sure that that's actually all the way clean. All right, drink up. Whoa, we're gonna have to test this system out one way or another. Can't be shy, right? All right, I don't know how long we wanna run this or how long it's gonna take. It's starting to look pretty good, though. I'm kind of surprised by the color, though. I don't know. It's not bad. I mean, it tastes organic, but... I could probably live off that, yeah. everybody I'm gonna do something a little different with this video right here um, actually uh, we are approaching April Fool's Day and if you've been watching my channel the last couple years you will have saw that I like to have fun on April Fool's with my YouTube followers uh, I think the first year I did some video where I was basically straight face to the camera I said well selling the RV I got a job at the office firm <laughs> uh, <laughs> gonna put on the suit and tie and and give it away and then just, and then I just ended the video and made people wait till the next day and then last year uh, I did another one where uh, I did something oh fuel I made my RV fueled by tater tots and I, I filled the uh, fresh water holding tank with beer so that when you open the tap outside you can just drink beer right out of there uh, this year I have two ideas first one's just kind of stupid but I got some food coloring, so what I want to do is uh, make it look like mold using the green one. So, um, and then keep a straight face and eat moldy bread in front of the camera while I talk about what I'm going to do to the RV. And this is kind of, it's borderline raunchy, but 
my idea is to uh, say that I'm going to repurpose uh, the contents of my black tank. Uh, basically, my number ones are going to be filtered or something, and then we're going to be drinking them. That's hence the apple juice idea here. So I'm going to be filming the whole video on my Canon Vixia here, which means I can use the GoPro for the behind the scenes stuff for this. So uh, anyway, I'm just going to do like behind the scenes type stuff so you guys can see how I kind of create a video, uh, how I kind of come up with stuff because I just I got some clearance tube tubing at Ace, this chinky little valve, um, a connector. This I'm actually going to use to eventually probably pour in the apple juice somehow by the sink to make that look good. And I got clear cups so that uh, so that you can see the liquid in the cup. Uh, but yeah, enjoy the ride. All right. So I've never done this before. I've seen other people do it. Uh, I think this is going to be pretty easy, pretty basic. Uh, we'll do a ham and cheese sandwich is what we'll do. And it's nighttime right now, so that's why I've got all of the lights on uh, inside. Can I do anything with the yellow, red, and blue? I'll have to think about that. Oh, I think I might put on a glove, too. I don't want to overdo it too much. Some on the crust too. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, I don't want to hold the die though. I can't get it everywhere. I really don't want to overdo it too much. I think that's good right there, actually. So, like, you know how some people get really excited about Halloween? That's how I am when I'm working on April Fool's. That's how I feel as far as the smile and everything. And I... Jax, you can't come over here. This is not for you. Uh, no, this is not for you. This is for me. Actually, it's a joke for everybody else. And we're not sharing. Excuse me. We're not sharing, remember? You, did you forget? Yeah, you forgot. All right. So, <laughs> there's my moldy sandwich, guys. You look realistic. I think we need some more light. All right. I don't want to get the dye on me. I'll make sure I take a bite like right into it or something. Oh, this is gonna be great. All right, let's set up the intro here. <clears throat> Maybe go like this, just to change things up. Zoom out like that. See, I can see myself in the screen of this camera, so. Um, basically say hey guys it's raining it is raining outside so hey guys it's uh, raining outside so I got a really important project I've been thinking about doing here in the RV I got the supplies and I think you'll be really interested to see this project come together yeah I think that'll work excuse me excuse me you are always stealing the spotlight putts you have to come down that looks nasty on the screen. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> oh, how about we hit record? Hey guys, it has been raining tonight. It has been raining a lot, so Jax and I are doing RV activities. I already fed him, so now I'm eating. Um. <laughs> oh, I don't just. Just missed that piece of green. I've been thinking about this project for a long time. 
went to Ace Hardware, got a bunch of supplies. I'm going to try to kind of walk you guys through how I'm going to put it all together. Uh, but bear with me. This is a work in progress. I don't know if we're going to get it all done today and tested, but uh, I'm really excited about this, and I think you guys are going to like that, how it turns out. <laughs> I did. I ate right off the green. Oh, that's perfect. All right. Let's get a new camera angle. Put you guys over on the coffee pot there. Uh, this light right here is too bright. There we go. So I have lots of supplies here, guys. What the heck are we doing? Well, I had come to the conclusion that I'd fixed my the liquids and make it drinkable. So let's get started in the bathroom. They're gonna be shaking their heads already. They're like, this guy's nuts. All right, way to keep a straight face though. My moly sandwich. Use this to hold the camera. far can I get this down? I'm trying to think here. Oh really? Um, bottom of the funnel uh, between where the actual tank hits and where the actual toilet is and then I'm going to run it back along this way to tap into the fresh water. Clear it. Yeah, that worked. That was believable. This will be tricky because they won't be able to see anything, but that's okay. All right, now I can access the funnel down below underneath and tap into it. Okay, now we need to show connecting a piece. I want this kind of messy on purpose because I don't want people to actually see and be able to figure it out. All right, I got my valve all installed here. This will be the on-off switch uh, when I don't want to have the toilet water running through here. Uh, we're just gonna tap into it right here, and then we're gonna add our filter at this point right here. Filter, okay. Now I need the fake, I'm just gonna use one of my extra Brita filters. I'll find my extra filters, I just took the one off my sink, and I'll just say I got it on eBay and just leave it at that. Maybe it'll be funnier if I say, that, say it that way. Uh, set this camera up on the ground, I guess, like that. All right, recording. All right, this is the filter I got on eBay, and it's, it actually says right in the description that this will completely sanitize and repurpose urine. So we're gonna hook this guy in here and then bypass the hose. I have lots of hose so I can get this to wherever I need it to get to. And I'm gonna run the hose uh, all the way back. It's <laughs> so loose on there. I'll drink the water and say that I need to purge the system or something. Before we go any farther, I realize that I actually should drink some water so that I can uh, be able to purge the system because it's going to take a few cycles to make sure that that's actually all the way clean. All right, drink up. All right, next. 
You have to do the fake pain in the toilet. I don't know how I'm going to film that. What if... Actually, I'm going to save the fake peen for last. Let's do the fake pouring from the sink first. Which means i got to clean the sink. Darn it. I do dishes. Hang on, I'll be back. It definitely feels weird to do this in reverse order. But just in case, I don't want part of this to like accidentally touch the toilet or... I don't know. I just want to finish the cleaner stuff before we do the toilet stuff, basically. So, yeah. How I'm going to do this is I'm going to set the camera up like this but so that you can't see the top of this so that everything that happens up here will be out of sight something like this and then I'll be holding a cup here oh I'll make it out or actually maybe I can just do it right oh I'll tape it and that way it'll be right there. And then I could be like, oh, I'm double filtering it here, so don't worry. Yeah, that's what we'll do. Can you see any of the tape? No, I don't think you can see it. Hello, Eric. You can see the bottom of the apple juice. Let's just try a take and see what this looks like. All right, I don't know how long we want to run this or how long it's going to take. It's starting to look pretty good, though. I'm kind of surprised by the color, though. I don't know. feel like it should have been a little less that color. I'll go ahead and try it. It's not bad. I mean, it tastes organic, but I could probably live off of that, yeah. Okay. Now we'll stop this. And we'll play back that last part. I just want to watch it first. Well, you can totally tell that I'm doing something because my arm, shoulder, this is moving. I think that it'll be okay if I cut part of it and just go straight to drinking because you still saw it come out yellow. They'll be like, wait, that's his real sink. Why is there really yellow coming out of a sink? Um, so yeah, that's cool. Now we got to do the tacky part. I guess we have to pee in the toilet and but there's probably a tactful way to do it. Well, if I pour apple juice, yeah, that'll work. <laughs> I'll have to like turn completely like this, but you still got to see the stream. Okay, is it recording? We'll just try some of this. Realistic. There we go. Well, that 
to test this system out eventually, so here we go. It's not a steady stream. There we go. All right, well, I'm going to test this system out officially here. Before I waste all the apple juice, let's <coughs> check that one, make sure that looks okay. Can't see the stream. Darn it. this time. Well, we're going to test this system out one way or another. Can't be shy, right? That one had to have worked. Perfect. Are we done with this? Uh, yeah? Yeah? All right. Let's edit. Hey guys, this is Jax, my kitty cat. I'm his servant, Eric. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel here on RVing. If you like the video, give us a thumbs up below. Make sure you subscribe, check out all our other videos, and keep following us on the road. Thanks, guys.